What's up, what's up guys? Just wanted to make a quick video about embracing your cross. Embracing the cross that is in front of you. We need to look at the cross and see it as a victory. God wants us to pick up our crosses. So the things that are in front of us right now, all the things that we're going through, you know, you might be going through struggles and you're saying, why me, why me, why does this have to happen to me? Well, we need to investigate, ask God, why? You know, we say, why me, God? I mean, Jesus, in a way, did the same thing before he went up on the cross. He was praying and he said, Lord, if you can, you know, let this pass, please. But if not, do as you will, right? Let your will be done. And that's what we need to do is when we're going through pain or we're going through suffering or something's just not going right, we need to figure out why. So pray, say, Lord, if you can have this pass, if this is not from me, please take it away. But at the same time, embrace that cross and realize that, hey, if, if there's a reason for this, then I'm gonna embrace it. Just the way Jesus embraced the cross and said, hey, this is what I'm meant for. I'm meant to die for you. I'm meant to be the sacrifice for you. I'm meant to do this so I can save you. We need to be able to say to this cross that's in front of us to say, hey, I'm down with it. Do as you will, Lord Father. Know that this is here for a reason. It's for you to grow and for you to jump over that hurdle and just do it and take it head on, come on. Let's go for it because we don't know what's beyond that. We don't know the victory that's beyond that. What is your reason? What is your purpose? What does God have you here for? Maybe we're running away. Maybe you're supposed to go that way, go on that path. Even if it is rocky, even if it is tough, pick up that cross, my brothers and sisters. You can do it because God's there with you. He's walking with you. Believe in him, pray to him, ask him. If this is your will, Lord, let it be done.